In the depths of the Baltic Sea, a new breed of hunter emerged, challenging the established order of naval warfare. This was the Gotland-class submarine, a Swedish marvel of engineering that would rewrite the rules of engagement. The Gotland class with its unique capabilities forced naval strategists to reconsider their tactics, ushering in a new era where stealth and cunning could challenge even the mightiest of warships. Sweden, a nation known for its neutrality and advanced technological development, had long recognized the strategic importance of submarine warfare. The Gotland class was the culmination of decades of research and development, a testament to Swedish ingenuity and their commitment to maintaining a strong defense posture. Their stealth capabilities and advanced sensors would allow them to effectively monitor the Baltic Sea, acting as silent sentinels guarding Sweden's maritime borders. At the heart of the Gotland-class submarine success lay a revolutionary technology, Air Independent Propulsion, or AIP. This innovative system allowed the submarine to operate submerged for far longer periods than traditional diesel-electric submarines. With AIP, the Gotland could remain hidden beneath the waves for weeks at a time, its presence virtually undetectable by enemy forces. The AIP system utilized a Stirling engine, a Swedish innovation that offered exceptional efficiency and silent operation. Unlike conventional diesel engines, the Stirling engine produced minimal noise and vibrations, making the Gotland incredibly difficult to detect using sonar technology. Further enhancing its stealth capabilities was the Gotland's anechoic coating, a specialized material that absorbed sonar waves instead of reflecting them. Even when operating in close proximity to enemy vessels, the Gotland could slip past undetected, its presence a whisper in the ocean currents. Beyond its advanced propulsion and stealth technology, the Gotland-class submarine incorporated numerous design innovations that enhanced its agility and maneuverability underwater. One such innovation was its X-shaped rudder, a departure from the traditional cross-shaped design found on most submarines. This unique rudder configuration provided the Gotland with exceptional turning capabilities, allowing it to execute tight maneuvers and change depth rapidly. The submarine's hull design also contributed to its agility. Unlike the traditional cylindrical hull shape, the Gotland featured a more streamlined, teardrop-shaped hull that reduced drag and enhanced its underwater speed and maneuverability. To minimize noise and vibrations, the Gotland incorporated advanced noise reduction technologies with machinery mounted on special shock-absorbing platforms. Section 4. A Giant Vanquished, the Gotland's Triumph over the USS Ronald Reagan. In 2005, the Gotland-class submarine's capabilities were put to the ultimate test during a joint naval exercise with the United States Navy. The exercise, codenamed JTFEX-05-2, pitted the Gotland against the USS Ronald Reagan, a Nimitz-class nuclear-powered aircraft carrier. The Gotland, with its stealth technology and superior maneuverability, repeatedly outmaneuvered the American warships, slipping past their defenses undetected. On multiple occasions, the Gotland managed to get within firing range of the Ronald Reagan, simulating torpedo attacks that would have crippled or sunk the massive aircraft carrier. The exercise demonstrated that even the most powerful surface combatants were vulnerable to attack by smaller, more agile submarines equipped with advanced stealth technology. Section 5. The Future of Naval Warfare. Lessons from the Silent Hunter. The Gotland-class submarine's success served as a wake-up call for navies around the world. It highlighted the growing importance of submarine warfare in the 21st century and the need for naval forces to adapt to this changing landscape. The future belonged to stealthy, agile submarines that could operate effectively in littoral waters, challenging the dominance of traditional naval powers. The Gotland's legacy extended beyond its technological achievements. It demonstrated the importance of innovation and adaptability in maintaining a credible deterrent. The Gotland's legacy lived on, shaping the future of naval warfare and reminding the world that even in the vastness of the ocean, silence could be the deadliest weapon of all.